Hi everyone, since some of my followers asked about how to move system compatibility report from the startup of After Effects, I prepared this video. As you may know, this message came up at the end of the 2019 when you run Premiere Pro and After Effects. At the beginning, this problem could be solved by running F12 and uncheck DVA system compatibility report enable. But after couple updates, that method couldn't help users to remove that message. So in this video, I will show you two possible solutions for two different versions of After Effects. As you see in the screen, the first version is 1701 build 52. I will show you how you can remove system compatibility report message when you run the program. As you see, when we run the program, we have a system compatibility report warning on the screen. We continue by pressing continue with known issues and wait for the program to be opened. After opening the software, press F12 to open console menu. In the screen press 3 line and press debug database view. In the search bar type report enable and uncheck the box which is at the left of DVA system compatibility report enable line to convert true to false. After that close after effects then rerun the program. As you see, the system compatibility report warning has gone. Now let's try to solve this issue with the After Effects version 17.5.1 build 47. When we open the software, we get the same warning about the system compatibility issue. As we have done with the previous version, press continue with known issues and wait for the program to be opened. The solution is little bit easy comparing to previous version. To remove the warning, press Edit, then press References, then press General from the pull-down menu. In the open window, uncheck the box which is at the left side of Show System Compatibility Issues at Startup. After this, press OK. To see whether the issue has been solved or not, close the program and reopen it. As you see, we don't get any warning about the system compatibility issue. Thanks for watching the video. If you liked the video, press like button and subscribe to my channel. Also, don't forget to activate notification option to be informed about the future contents.